What's up, everybody, and welcome back to the channel. I am back from the unknown, and today we have a pre-release box for the Caverns of Ixalan. And for a little bonus, we have a set booster as well, kind of like a uh, little tournament we'll have here. So let's go ahead and take a look what is in this set. I have not played in a pre-release yet. But I thought this set looked really cool and a whole lot of fun, especially with the uh, possibility of getting cards from Jurassic Park. Now, I was told that the Jurassic Park cards are only 1 in 12 that you can get. So that's kind of disappointing. That's a cool die. I like that. Uh, but maybe we'll get lucky and get something cool. All right, let's see what's in here. All right, that looks cool. Um, here we got this. Maybe we got a good card. We got a rare, at least. It's better than an uncommon. There might be another one behind it. Let's see if we can get this out. If you guys went to any pre-release tournaments, let me know in the comments down below. I'll set that a little bit. So it looks like, oh, I love seeing that. That looks fantastic. Okay. So this comes with one, two, three, four, five, six draft packs and a set booster. So let's go ahead and start cracking some packs. I'm kind of disappointed about the uh, one in 12 with the... Uh, Jurassic Park and at my local LGS store they only had the um, the pre-release and some set boosters they did not have the collector boosters normally I like to do one of these with a collector booster however if they are all sold out that kind of makes it a little bit difficult so I'm gonna have to wing it and see they said everything should be in, oh, this is a cool card, by next week. Oh, that token. But it's the first time that I can recall they've only had a few, um, well, I, I shouldn't say they had a few. They had a lot of set boosters and draft boxes, um, set boxes and draft boxes. Market gnome. All right, saw some things with gnomes earlier. Oh, okay. And looking at, and looking at the set booster here, it looks like only the set booster has the possibility for the Jurassic Park. I don't see any markings on that for the draft booster. So we'll wait until the end to test that one. Anything cool? And again, this is just to get an overview of the set, just see if it's worth it. I always like to see if, not only if we get a decent like stamped card, because I think that's pretty cool. I always like to see if there's anything, oh, look at that, that's pretty cool. Geo Grotto. Um, if it's worth buying other products of a set. Souls of the Lost. And look at that mountain. That's a cool full art mountain. Let's see here. Another draft pack. I've never made a dinosaur deck, but with all the dinosaurs that are in this, it might be time. And there are a lot of awesome reprints in this set. I am liking that. We'll see if I can get anything decent here. Oh, some more dino. Oh, look at that. That's a really cool card. I like that. I'm not even going to attempt to pronounce it, but that's an awesome card. Oh, look at that. Tidebender. That's our rare. There's our foil. Oh, and not a token, but we got that. Oh, 
fungus token. He does inquisitor. Okay. I can definitely find a home for that card. Okay. Yeah, I like the, the Mayan... The Mayan theme with this is pretty cool. Alright, that's cool. Um... Obviously, we all want that Mana Crypt. I'm really crossing my fingers. That maybe I can find some... Oh, that's a cool forest, too. That maybe we can find something cool. And uh, maybe some single pools. Or just something else. We'll see. Maybe we'll do some other stuff with this set. A map token. Okay. I'm checking to see if we do have any of those uh, Jurassic Park cards, but I don't think we're going to get lucky with these draft packs. I think they are only in set and collector boosters. Maybe one is guaranteed in the collector boosters. Oh, that's cool. The great door. The core. Ooh, legendary. Okay, that's kind of interesting. What did we get? Hidden. Okay. Well, that only leaves us with the set booster left. Let's go ahead and crack this, and maybe we'll get lucky and get a Jurassic Park card. I doubt it, but you never know. Alright, so I guess that's our token that thing let's see if these are set up differently than the draft oh yep yeah. dire flail I guess that's our rare okay I love those new I like the style on those new cards all right so I take it that was our uh, our rare another thing too I heard the Jurassic Park cards could have a land card as the the dinosaur card, or as the Jurassic Park card. So that's really disappointing. Oh, and we have a foil land and our uh, Chalice of the Void. That's another sought after card for this set. All right, guys, let me know what you think of Lost Caverns of Ixalan. Did you participate in a pre release? Let me know in the comments down below. I am Batkerm the Unknown. Hit that like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Batkerm out. Pew.